Hello, this video is regarding the Bluetooth uh, PLE in ESP IDF for ESP32 and here we will concentrate only how to set up the ESP IDF environment particularly the menu config for the Bluetooth BLE functionality. In order to do so, we will open a project and copy a BLE, Nimble uh, BLE to be precise, file inside this project. First of all, let's uh, create the project. Uh, okay. Uh, let's call him Proj Four. Okay, and we have our project created. Uh, now let's open this project inside uh, and uh, copy our file uh, inside. Uh, he, here he didn't uh, really uh, recognize any of the includes so uh, we will compile it uh, okay Now what we are expecting is uh, our editor to recognize the include files after the compilation. Okay, here what's happened during the compilation that the standard includes were recognized and regarding the ESP nimble hci.h that means the first include which includes the nimble, B, nimble BLE the Bluetooth files we got an error and we, we have all those uh, services related to Bluetooth uh, are uh, pointed as not recognizing includes. What we should do in order to fix it and in actually in the beginning on every Bluetooth uh, project we have to run the menu config and define the uh, Bluetooth or BLE functionality. So we'll write Okay, inside the component config, we have a Bluetooth uh, section. First of all, we have to choose the Bluetooth. Another important thing, inside Bluetooth host, instead BlueDroid dual mode, we will use Nimble, because we are using Nimble files here. Okay, we should save it. and uh, escape and now we will try to build it uh, once again and 
In that case, the compiler uh, have to rebuild the entire project. Okay, and now the compile was successful and we have all those includes uh, fixed. In this way, it's important to set up every Bluetooth or BLE project in the beginning of the ESP IDF uh, project. Thank you.